All right, I'm going to explain a few things uh, about this drill press adapter I made for the uh, Dremel. Little drill press to hold the soldering iron so that you can do nut heat set nut inserts. Um, basically, there's just a bolt in the bottom and uh, there's this little guide on the side. I decided to go ahead and, and use that uh, just to help hold it stable. Um, so let me, all you got to do is print this plate out. Now the plate, there's two screws here. These are M3s and there are, it's, a, it's two parts, it splits right here. There are heat set nuts already in this side so you have to use those uh, to get this to bolt on. It's just a friction fit onto the grip. Uh, this is a Weller 40 watt soldering iron and it uh, got a screw here and then you can put these brass inserts in. These brass inserts are, I got these on uh, Amazon, got a full set goes all the way from M2 to M5 or 6, something like that. It was like 25 bucks for those. Okay, so let me get some specs here because there's something you got to know. Um, with the thickness that I made this, the original screw, the original bolt for the bottom, is not quite long enough. Okay, so what you need is a 5 16 20. This is a SAE bolt because that's what the threads are in the Dremel and you need one that's three-quarter inch this is a half inch okay um, not a whole lot to it it's not perfectly straight with the machine but it works uh, I thought it was fairly straight when I built it the first time if I were to build it again I would just take this whole here and move it ever so slightly but the fact is it works perfectly I've already used it a couple of times uh, the drill press has a knob back here you can loosen and go up and down with the whole thing and then of course the handle over here does that this allows you to tilt tilt it but for our purposes it's useless that's basically it um, I'm going to go ahead and post these files on uh, Prusa's website where they have their 3D printable items. And uh, I think I've explained everything. If you've already got one of these, great, you can adapt it. If you don't, this, this is about $45, bucks, $44, $45 on Amazon. Um, there's the... Model number 126, no, model 220. Model 220, okay. And that's basically it. The soldering iron you need, the bits you need, uh, the extra screw you need, and of course some heat set inserts you need to go along with it. Okay. And uh, if you enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up. If you make one, I'd like to see it. Uh, you can post it over on the Prusa website. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good one.